hi welcome to you all in my youtube channel and today is going to discuss about registration person as a pharmacist in ireland this is you it about if if you are not from uh, europe so this is our non-European countries in the world, whatever your country, if you want to work as a registered pharmacist in Ireland. So we are going to discuss in the whole uh, in the detail. I earlier made that one video about the pharmacy education in Ireland. So you can watch that video also so you can understand that uh, what are the subject and uh, how the process as a pharmacist in the Ireland um, education. Uh, I, I learned master degree mostly the five years there. So we are going to be here if you are a pharmacist from any the country want to work as a registered pharmacist in Ireland. So Ireland you know I can say one of the most beautiful country and is very small country the population is just uh, 5 million less than 5 million the population and uh, yeah the salary is very good is about 55k yearly this is in on average you can earn in more yeah or or somewhat less as well so this is in the world if you are we company is a seventh uh, rank in the world the, the uh, by the salary by about in the us in the number one and the island is uh, on the seventh rank is equivalent to if you are working is in the um the uk as well so if you want to work in Ireland, you must to be a registered pharmacist with the Pharmaceutical Society of Ireland. This also we can call it a PSI. So if you are new in my channel, so please go and subscribe my channel. I already uploaded more than 150 videos in different different countries. So if you want to work as a pharmacist in any of the country in the world, I already upload and I'm going to upload day by day new new videos. So the registration process in Ireland. So this is this video is about if you are not from Europe. So non-European countries, any country is yours. You have to be a registered pharmacist in Ireland. So I can give you. So there is a four uh, part process here. So we can discuss here one by one. So there are four stages involved in the registration process of pharmacist in Ireland. First. Uh, they will assess your degree recognition your degree is recognized I mean your degree is equivalent to Ireland or not secondly you have to give a one exam this is called OSCE exam this is the equivalency exam so your degree can be equivalent if you pass this then pass then then you have to go stage three essentially the adaptation period we call uh, it is period is like six months to three years so this is based on individual persons for example some person can learn in very fast so they can maybe finish in six months the other can be in up to uh, eight months ten months or maybe one year so you know this is so they make this program adaptation period is a individual basis in that you have to go for a certain training you write some exams and all these and finally stage in the fourth stage this is called a professional registration examination this is called pre and this is accredited by the psi pharmaceutical society of ireland we will discuss one by one here so applicants are required to first apply for the PSI for the qualification recognition you know you have to apply then you will see their degree qualification is meet their criteria then you have to write an exam so for this in uh, Ireland mostly if you are degree is five year total five year you are uh, eligible to write this exam for example uh, you are farmed from pakistan five year yes you are eligible you are farmed from india six year yes you are eligible to uh, write this exam uh, but the question is here uh, b form can write or not so straightforwardly they are written that uh, B form cannot eligible any four year degree is not eligible here if your degree is five year or more years you are eligible here another question is here the farm D P B can write or not maybe you can write but you have to write them separate email to them and you have to uh, uh, straightforward you can write everything there is a one year uh, training in this and you do this and uh, then they can be give a exemption to you so you can also write an exam so any degree of uh, four year degree plus one year internship 
so this is total five year or maybe a uh, four and a half year degree and six month internship then this degree they are recognized so you can write uh, this examination so already very advantage here those are farm d they can write this exam other b firm cannot write so already they are scrutinized here so many very few people are uh, are uh, applying for this uh, for ireland so the farm d student have a advantage to work as a pharmacist in ireland the document required your degree certificate your registration all these then you have to go for a english requirement english especially if your il7 or oet occupational english test also a in b in all modules and il7 in each module so you can write this examination the fee is about 1500 euro this is not refundable and after this process they will give you a validation certificate they will issue a validation certificate then you have to go for a stage 2 a stage 2 is a equivalency examination this is called uh, like a OSCE assessment this is like a something um, and if you are from India Pakistan maybe you don't know about this you can see some separate video I'm going to make another separate video about OSCE assessment OSCE is a, especially if you are looking for Canada uh, US and Ireland as well you know most of the advanced countries OSCE is there and even in Australia as well so in Indian syllabus they are not included that, that this is the disadvantage for India Indian students so you can see uh, separately all this and this examination uh, yearly twice they conducted so you can be right the, the first you are um, your degree is uh, s6 equivalency then this OSCE exam you have to write then this is the third stage the adaptation program adaptation program can be a six month to three year this is based on the individual person this is a training or we can say the uh, internship kind of things and this is most of the time is a paid so this is uh, very good for you and finally this is a stage four this is a professional registration examination applicant who successfully completed the adaptation period are then eligible to undertake the psi psi means the uh, pharmaceutical society of ireland uh, this is called a professional registration examination pre this examination will finally assist and confirm that you possess the knowledge skill and competencies and you are appropriate for practice as a pharmacist in ireland if you want to see the that the oski uh, i already told you about oski adaptation program anything if you have any or uh, many videos many uh, things they already upload in their website so just uh, i just said i can say here you just go to their website psi pharmaceutical society of ireland and uh, they already uh, summarize here like a stage one a stage two stage three so you can go here you can see here this is a application form then this is a certificate of identity form now all everything they are provided in their website so you please go to their website and refer to the website then you can be understand uh, more easily if you have any questions you know, you can ask me and thank you for watching this video